We're going to get started on chapter five for Cam Jansen and the Mystery of the Dinosaur Bones. Take out your book and your worksheet. There's only three questions up for chapter five. Turn to page 27. Chapter five. It was one of the museum guards. Come with me, he said. So remember, they were hiding in the museum and um, a man bent down and looked at them right in the eyes because they wanted to find out who took the Silaphysis bones. So, it was one of the museum guards. Come with me, he said. The guard led them out of the dinosaur room through the museum lobby to the office of the museum director. The guard knocked on the door and walked in. Cam and Eric followed him. The walls of the office were covered with paintings of prehistoric animals. There were statues of famous scientists and large stuffed animals all over the room. Cam and Eric couldn't find the director among all those paintings and statues. Didn't you hear the bell? The director asked. Then Cam and Eric saw him. He was sitting between a statue of a woman scientist and two stuffed owls. Yes, we heard the bell, Cam said, but three dinosaur bones are missing. Someone is stealing bones from the tail of the Coelophysis skeleton and we want to see who it is. That's impossible, the director said, stroking his beard. Nothing is missing. But if you want to watch over the Coelophysis, you can come back tomorrow when the museum opens. Then he said to the guard, now please take these children to the door and make sure that this time they leave the museum. Cam and Eric followed the guard to the front entrance. The guard opened the door with a key and let them out. Now what? Eric asked. There's nothing we can do, Cam said. We can't get back inside, so let's go home. While Cam and Eric started to unlock their bicycles, a truck rode past them. It backed into the museum driveway. A sign painted on the side of the truck said, Beth's milk tastes best. That's strange, Cam said. Milk is usually delivered early in the morning, not late in the afternoon. A man in a white uniform got out of the truck. He was carrying an empty milk box. Maybe some of the milk went bad, Eric said, and he's picking it up. The milkman knocked on the garage door. The door opened and he went inside. He came out a few minutes later carrying a large brown bag in the box. He put it in the truck. There's probably a whole bunch of containers of sour milk in that bag, Eric said. Cam and Eric heard the door on the other side of the truck open and someone get inside, but they couldn't see who it was. Who, let's predict, let's stop there. Who do you think got into the other side of the truck? All right, let's see if you're right. Then the truck backed up. As the truck passed them, Cam read the sign again. There's something else that's strange about that truck, Cam said. She closed her eyes and said, click. So remember when she does that, she's going back to her memory to try to find what she remembers about the milk. The museum doesn't use Beth's milk, it uses Edna's. That's what it said on the milk container you bought in the cafeteria. Cam got on her bicycle. She turned to Eric and said, that man wasn't picking up sour milk. He was picking up something else. Come on, let's follow the truck. That is the end of chapter five. Let's turn to the worksheet. Why do Cam and Eric find it hard to see the director in his own office? Going back to that page, why is it hard to see the director in his office? Okay. They couldn't find him. Why was that? So let's start off the sentence. It was hard to see the director. And what's that keyword? Because, and I want you to finish this sentence. Because why? Why was it hard to see the director? Don't just write, it was hard to see the director because Finish that sentence. The next one. Why is Cam surprised to see a delivery truck at the museum? Okay, let's turn and find that in our book. That's strange, Cam said. Milk is not usually delivered early in the morning, or milk is usually delivered early in the morning, not late in the afternoon. Why is Cam surprised to see a delivery truck at the museum? Cam is surprised because Milk is what? What did she say? Milk is usually delivered when? Usually delivered in the morning. 
And what time of the day was it? It was in the afternoon. So she was surprised because milk is usually delivered in the morning. The last one, what else is odd about this milk truck? Okay, I'm gonna give you a hint. What else is odd about this milk truck? Look at page 31. There's something else that's strange about that truck, Cam said. She closed her eyes and said, click. The museum doesn't use Beth's milk, it uses Edna's. That's what it said on the milk container you bought in the cafeteria. So now what did we just read? What else is odd about this milk truck? Okay, finish answering that. We're gonna get started with chapter six next. Great work, boys and girls.